So you get started with a 7x7 seven seven area. They place 4 blocks over here and 4 blocks over here right in the middle. They place a stone pressure plate for yourself to stand on and another pressure plate for the other player. Then a stone pressure plate over here to get back your items if you don't want to accept the trade. And also have another pressure plate for the other player of course. They will take out these 9 blocks so you can place 2 droppers over here. And also for yourself of course. Make sure these are not dispensers but are actually droppers. They place two hoppers running into this dropper. And also over here. They place three blocks. Two half slabs. Some glass. Two glass panes. And finally four stairs. Well guys, now it's time for the redstone, so we go to these two droppers over here, so we can place a 3x3 platform. And now we can place a redstone comparator over here, facing in this direction. Place down 3 blocks. Take out this block, and place down 3 redstone repeaters, also not one tick. Now we do the same thing for these two droppers. So once again, a 3x3 platform. Redstone comparator, blocks, and the redstone repeaters. Now we go to this stone pressure plate and we place down some blocks like this. A redstone torch on this block with four redstone dust. And the same thing for this pressure plate. Place down your blocks. Redstone torch and for redstone dust. Now we place some more blocks over here. Place down a line of redstone. A repeater over here is so now one tick. Another repeater over here also set so on one tick. A block with a redstone torch. A block with redstone, two blocks like this, then you go under this hopper and you place a redstone torch with a block on it, and also over here a redstone torch with a block on it. Now we go under this pressure plate so we can place a sticky piston. And also over here, a sticky piston again. And now we just cover up the area with some more blocks. Now if you want to test this out, you can just replace this stone pressure plate for a wooden pressure plate and drop an item on it. Or ask one of your friends to stand on the pressure plate. So we're going to test this pressure plate first. It works. And now this pressure plate, so make sure both uh, players are standing on the pressure plate. And now as you can see we successfully traded the items. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you did, make sure to hit that like button. And if you want to see more of this, make sure to subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for more videos. But anyway guys, thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time.